Hi you guys, Lindsay again, and I have a huge stack of stash builder boxes. This is a stash builder box stack. Um, and as you know by now, if you've been watching the last couple weeks, um, you know that it's been a while since I have uploaded some videos. Um, but that doesn't mean that the stash builder boxes didn't ship. Um, they arrived and I put them away and I haven't opened any of them and this is March, this is April, and this is May's. So we are going to open all of these together here today and see what came. Um, I know that when I made the pajamas out of the stash folder box, I don't remember when it came. Um, that was so much fun and I know that I'm going to do that again. Those pajamas are so comfortable and breathable and they're just perfect for the summer. So I'm excited to see what kind of fabrics I got to see what might make some good, some other good pajamas. What am I trying to say? You know I'm trying to say? Like just see what other fabrics came. See if they'd be good pajama fabric. I want to try new pajama patterns. That's what I'm trying to say. Um, and so I'm excited to see the fabrics and how they might work with these other patterns. Now I got it. Okay, so first things first. Again, this I believe, let me double check. March. Yes, this is March. Um, and here's the fabrics. Interesting. Um, you always get a little envelope thingy okay so there's everything that came inside let's get right into it the envelope comes with your patterns always a pencil always some thread so this pencil says a sewing day is a good day amen I actually use these pencils all the time I love writing with pencils um, and these are really good nice pencils love them um, I have a whole collection now. Looks like we've just got some black or fill thread. Um, the card that tells you where the block of the month is, if you're into quilting, because this is a quilter's box technically, but even though I'm a garment sewer, I do find ways to use the fabrics, like either with facings or pocket bags or small projects, you know, cosmetic bags, all those kinds of stash busters. Um, so they are now donating, they are incredibly generous um, with their profits. Um, so it looks like Camp Hobe um, is a summer camp experience designed expressly for children currently undergoing cancer treatments and similar disorders, as well as for their siblings. I mean, doesn't that make you feel good and warm and fuzzy that you get to help sick kids and their siblings go to an awesome summer camp? gives me that warm and fuzzy feeling truly um and then the stash um pick of the month this is an exclusive quilt pattern just for stash builder box subscribers um and this one is called minnows and it looks like little fish swimming cute okay now let's get to the part that let's be real really matters so we got a cotton and steel ribbon which is indicative of this is going to be cotton and steel line this is their Sleep Tight collection by Sarah Watts. Um, your box features three yards from the brand new collection. Sleep Tight. So this is all a monochromatic collection. Here's the whole thing. You can see all nine blocks there. So not everybody gets the same fabric as me. Um, Different fabrics are shipped to different people just randomly. Um, so there could be some different boxes, contents out there, but this is what I got. I mean, is this not perfect for a garment sewer, right? I mean, it's just black and white polka dots and it's really cute, kind of like, um, you know, an irregular pattern. I mean, that could work in so many different applications. Um, yeah, it, it, that is a great garment sewer one what is this okay oh it has some, oh so it's oh it does have some color in it um so this one is black and kind of like a brownish army green and then it has neon dots on it with trees and footprints and clouds and waterfalls or are those rainbows i don't know <laughs> you you decide what you think it is but this is the next one 
this would be cute for like a gift for a little boy I don't know it's reading more masculine to me for some reason and then I also got this one this is cute so this one has um it's more of a traditional army green background and then it has some turquoise black and white birds so that's that and then the gray polka dots in the back so this will be a cool one to like fussy cut you know if you could cut around one of the birds and make that like the center of something that one would be really cool yeah okay so march is great because i got this and I get a, you get a yard of each of these in the stash builder boxes nowadays. Um, so yeah, I'm super excited about those. I'm not sure that these are gonna be great for pajamas, but these would be cool for gifts. This is gonna make its way into a garment somehow. I just don't know how. Um, they're only 45 inches wide, so you can't get like a tank top or anything like that out of one um just one yard so i'll have to play around with it but i love that i love this my favorite love it so much okay that's march isn't this fun we get to do so many in a row um it's like christmas for me okay sorry about that my camera ran out of memory they ran out of space so i was already into april's box um i showed the eat sleep sew pe uh, pencil which is super cute I showed the like periwinkle fabric. I mean, what is this thread? Um, and then I was going through all the cards. You get a lot more this time around. Um, there was the block of the month card, which shows where you go to get that. Um, then there was this thing from Tiny Toffee Designs. You get a free pattern from them. Um, and it looks like it's little teeny tiny hexagon paper piecing patterns. Um, but they're all really cute and sweet. I'm going to cover up the link because I'm not sure if I'm supposed to show that or not. But you can see there's like a bird. I think that's an envelope with a heart or something. Maybe a hot air balloon. I'm not exactly sure, but those are cute. Um, and then Sariella has this awesome quilt pattern called Deco Hex. I mean, look how gorgeous that is. It's so... I don't know, like grown up and modern and still art deco-y. I love it so much. Um, as you know, if you saw my um, if you saw my life update video, then you know I'm moving and that I'm getting an entire um, sewing room. I'm getting a dedicated sewing space for um, for myself and for all my filming and everything else. So I am going to be putting that sofa in that room um, and that's where I'm gonna do a lot of my filming and I was thinking about doing some since that sofa is just like an ivory color I was thinking about doing some like brighter more fun colors since that space is like an alternate space um, the colors in here now are like really calm and muted because I'm in here all the time but for something like a creative space I'm thinking like bright fun colors so I was thinking about long story short thinking about making a new quilt anyways and this pattern might be a front runner that is i mean i've gotten so many great quilt patterns from being a part of the stash builder box i have so many awesome ones to choose from but i don't know i really like this one and i like how i i think i mostly like the fabrics that they picked <laughs> let's be real but um but yeah it's really cool i like that one a lot a lot a lot um there's another card about camp hopi the same camp i talked about in last month's box um and then i was just getting to this story patches every quilt needs a label oh this is super cool for y'all out there so it's an app and you write out what you want it to say ready to use quilt labels connect personal videos photos or audio wait maybe it's not an app hold on reserve your quilt story every detail about your quilt Oh, so they print, oh, they, you go to their website, you sign up, you create a sticker, S-T-K-R, choose your message, save it. You can also use their app and then they will send you the label. Yeah. Oh. 
I'm confused. <laughs> I'm confused. You pick a design and then they mail that to you and then it comes with this QR code printed on it and you can write whatever you want around the design that you like this would be the design that I picked and then I would write you know the date and whatever I want but whenever you scan this QR code then it would take you to another place where you could have like a picture like if you made it for your grandson or grandchild you could have a picture there with more details about it that's what I'm thinking it is sorry story patches if I didn't get that right no quilt is complete without a label easy to use no matter your level or computer experience story patches anyways check that out if you're into that um and then the quilt this month is called dazzling diamonds plus a bonus quilt top pattern so let's you get two of them these are from she quilts a lot well that's cute let me see they have bigger oh that is cute do they have a bigger one of the other one no, no. I think this is the, I think this is the diamonds one. Hold on. Let me notch. Oh, there's one. Is that the diamonds one? Yeah. Okay. This is the diamonds one. That's cute. All over kind of design. And then, so that's dazzling diamonds. And then I don't know what this one is called. leftover love leftover love because I guess you can use all your scraps can you see leftover love cute super cute here's one of them made that's leftover love all made up pretty I recognize those fabrics too um, okay, now here's the fabric, and you guys, can you hardly believe it? It's Rifle Paper Company. That's exciting. So this is their Wonderland collection. Um, here are all of the designs that are in the um, fabric line. Cute. And then here are the ones that I got. So I got the black and well, I think it's like black and cream with rabbit hole, pool of tears. I don't know much about the background of this. Um, the like, I guess it's Alice in Wonderland. <laughs> I'm guessing so. The yeah, okay, right, okay. I'm with you now. Alice in Wonderland. Got it. Got it. There it is. Cute. Super cute. I love that like up close it has all that but from far away it just looks like an interesting little design. Teacups with a black background. Stacked teacups. How cute would this be in a tea towel or like a pan cozy or something in the kitchen? I mean it's a little bit basic and obvious but still super super cute. Love that. And then I got oh look at that gold. So this is um just has like all the characters and then there's like gold on it so that's super cute too that would actually make adorable pajamas right right maybe i'll go buy some more to make the i can't make shorts and the top from this from one yard um maybe i'll go get some more to make those fun i love themed fabric that's cute. So, love Rifle Paper Company. They just do awesome designs. Okay, next up and the last one out of this like three-peat video unboxing um, is the one that just came. So this is May's box. Oh my gosh. Okay. Okay. <laughs> okay. <laughs> bit of a tease there because I'm, I'm going to do the paper bag first but the fabric comes on top so I got a little sneak peek sorry it's awesome okay um <laughs> all right so what's in the bag the bag has white pencil this time and it says keep calm and scrap on 
Literally, you guys, I swear every single video or every single box I've ever gotten, the pencil has had a different saying on it. I haven't gotten one repeat. That's cool. That's really cool. I wonder like if she is thinking of these on her own and sending them to the pencil company. I don't know how that goes down. Um, more about Camp Hobie again. And then the, the, what is it called? Quilt pattern is called Flying Hexies. This one's cool. Kind of linear. You incorporate two different kinds. I like when, I like when they show like a finished version, but they didn't do that on this one. This one is by Simply Becca. B-E-K-A-H, Simply Becca. Alrighty, now on to the fabric. So these are Riley Blake fabrics. The other two obviously were cotton and steel. And how cute, it's called Gold and Rose Gold Basics. That's the name of the line. Oh, I'm in love. And here they all are. It's like whites and pinks and, you know, gold and rose gold. Very monochromatic, very simple. Oh, it's so sweet. Okay, which ones did I get? I got gold. What does it say on here? Create, creating to create. Um, something, then creativity. I don't know. It's all eat, sleep, create. So it's all about creating. And it's this white background with gold. And it does have a shimmer to it. How cute. I love that. I love the writing. It's kind of like that, you know, everybody's really into that um, hand lettering these days. That's what the script is kind of like, the font. <gasps> okay. Now we have, oh my God, a baby striped rose gold and white stripe and the rose gold has a little sparkle in it too guys how gorgeous is this i want to top from this so bad maybe like a um a the you know the um tunic bible top with the ruffle collar oh so cute i love rose gold obsessed okay and then i also got this gold dot so it's white background with teeny tiny gold dots on it you guys, this whole line is amazing. First of all, if you have a little girl, definitely you have to go get this. Um, it's hard to tell. It looks like they have like, oh, those look the exact same. So now, okay, so, um, like I don't know the difference in some of them, but they definitely have a stripe, a dot, and words in gold and rose gold. And then it looks like there's a third version of them, but they look the same to me. Maybe there's only... I don't know. I don't know. But they're so pretty. So pretty. Okay, what am I going to make? I have just opened up nine yards of fabric, guys. Nine yards here. What? Maybe I should stack them this way. I'm so excited. So, this is going to be pajamas and then some kind of top that I'll probably go buy more of the cotton to make the top. Um, this is going to be... Uh, pajamas and I'm gonna buy more to make the bottoms this is gonna be something for the new kitchen maybe I'll make a set like pot holders and you know a little oven mitt out of that so cute this I'm not sure I wish this and this went together better I mean that's not that bad right it's cream and black and then white and black but I mean if it's just pajamas then who cares but if not, at the very least, this would make really cute facings. This would make really cute facings. That would be cute. And then, wait. And then I got this one, this one. Oh, no, I'm missing one. Too many. Oh, I ended up sitting on it. <laughs> okay. Um, and then these, which I don't know what to make from this. From these two... What ideas do y'all have for those two? The bird and then the trees with neon dots. Hmm. Hmm. I'll have to think about those two. But all the others. Awesome. 
awesome, awesome, awesome stash builder box. Really just makes me so happy. I wish I would have opened these sooner and could have found some of this joy um, that I'm feeling right now um, in these sooner. But yeah, okay, so stash builder box. I have a coupon code if you're interested in getting one. $3 off your first box. Um, I'll have a link in the description box. Here's how you access the description box. I always have lots of information there. And yeah, these will keep coming. I know that there are some other subscription boxes out there. So you guys let me know if you've tried any other ones, if you're getting Stash Builder Box and got different fabrics than me, what you think, if you've seen this line somewhere, the um, Riley Blake Gold and Rose Gold Basics. Um, let me know what you think of those because I think they're gorgeous and amazing and just so awesome. Um, if you've gotten the Rifle Paper Company stuff, let me know what you've made with those. So yeah, just let me know what you guys, what you guys think about everything. Just comment. Let's chat. <laughs> Thanks so much for watching and I'll see you guys next time. Bye.